In the last video, I walked you through uh, some of the basics of using Dropbox. I just want to show you a couple tips and tricks to make things easier. So Dropbox is just a folder on your local computer. So um, whenever you have Windows Explorer open, it doesn't matter where you're at, uh, you can always go uh, into the Dropbox folder. And by default, it's kind of buried. It's in your user profile, so it's C, Windows users, your, um, your particular user profile, and then there's a Dropbox folder. Now, what I would recommend, and you don't have to get to it like that, obviously I showed you in the last video, you can always come down here and just say open Dropbox folder. But that's kind of a pain, and you're certainly not gonna wanna do that every time you have to save a file. So what I would recommend is to go up one level, get to uh, the point where you can see Dropbox here, and see over here in your list of favorites, now, it might already be added in your list of favorites as part of the install, but if it isn't, you can add any folder to that list of favorites by simply dragging it and dropping it, and you'll see Create Link in Favorites. And what that means is that any time I have this uh, open, I could just click on Dropbox and it will take me right to the file. Which means, for instance, that if I'm in Microsoft Word and I'm typing a document and I want to save it, I can go up here to File and I can say Save As and it will bring up my Windows Explorer window and then I can simply scroll up to uh, favorites say Dropbox and here's my Dropbox folder so I can put it into work and then store it in the folder that uh, you know that I need to store it in so we'll call this um, fake document and that way I don't have to work so hard to save stuff into my Dropbox folder now the other thing that you can do is to uh, drag and drop into your Dropbox folder because it is just a folder just like any other folder so I've got a folder in here in my documents called Mavidia Docs and I'm gonna go ahead and grab these two folders and I am going to drag them into uh, my work folder so I've got them highlighted and I'm just gonna move them down here and they're gonna copy in and now you'll see that there's little blue uh, indicators here meaning that they're not synced yet if we go to our Dropbox icon you can see it gives me a little status update that it's uploading five files, how fast it's uploading them. Um, I didn't quite get there. I can pause it if I wanted to, um, but I clearly don't want to. So now everything is synced up and all that stuff is stored inside of my Dropbox folder. And now I have the option of deciding which of these folders I really want to share out. So I could go up here to the main um, Dropbox folder and I could share out this entire work folder and all the subfolders. Or maybe I just want to share out this folder and I can do that. I can go into Dropbox and say share this folder. So I have total control over who I'm sharing uh, my files with.